asking us to read the law. He asked us to read the law because there is something significant about the agreement in the law. There is something that is so important for the words of the law to be read. Joshua chapter 1, verse 8. This book of the law shall not depart out of thy mouth, but thou shalt meditate therein day and night, that thou mayest observe to do according to all that is written therein. Wait, 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 wait. wait. David said, I believe, therefore I have spoken. And then Paul also came and said, as it is written, according to the words of faith, according to the spirit of faith, as it is written, I believe, and therefore I have also done what? Spoken. Because the Bible says that this book of the law shall not do what? Depart from your mouth. But thou shalt think about it. Thou shalt matter it. Thou shalt recite it. Thou shalt say it. Everywhere you go, the book must be your guide. You see, there's something interesting about tourism. You know, when you go to maybe central London, or during the Olympic Games, you'll find some people holding certain small booklets. It is called a tour guide. It is the law as to where you want to visit in the place where you are. If you don't look at the tour guide and the map of the, of, of the guide, you'll be lost. So God says that in order to get to where I have asked you to go, in our agreement, you must do something. He says that you must be able to know the context of the law. Mm. And the things that the law says and the benefit of the law. Mm. Some of us have not done so well. And therefore we have broken the agreement left and right. And that is the, the, the reason why we are not into where God wants us to do. God says that I have put before you this day life and what? Death. But choose life. Choose life. The choice is whose? The choice is yours. Some people say that I don't know why, why, why I'm poor. Maybe you are poor because you don't know the things that God says about riches. And you haven't read the constitution of riches in the book, in the agreement. Some people are not receiving their healing because they don't know what God says about healing. Some people say all the negative things about God and they haven't said any good thing about the agreement. Now let us continue to read because there's some interesting thing about when you meditate. Have not I commanded thee? No, well, let's go back to 8. We will finish 8. Um, this book of the law shall not depart out of thy mouth, but thou shalt meditate therein day and night, that thou mayest observe to do according to all that is written therein. For then thou shalt... For when? Then. For then. Mm. Thou shalt do what? Make thou thy way prosperous. And then thou shalt have good success. Thou shalt make your way. In the agreement, there is something about making of a way. Mm. Saying what you believe it belongs to you. It says that when you make the way of the law, because he has already told us that we should bring Israel and everybody in our household to read the law. Mm to read the hearing of the law and to meditate on the law. He says that when you meditate on the law, you will make your way prosperous and you will have good success. When you